Time travel plus system plus daily cultivation plus IQ online plus multi-beauty plus spiritual pets plus decisive killing plus early survival and development plus later opening and killing, the protagonist travels from Earth to the cultivation world and obtains the infinite spirit stone system, what, can't beat it. Directly purchase a large number of spiritual talismans to kill. Cultivation is too slow, it doesn't exist. Top grade spirit stones can be used. I heard you are a heart demon, a stumbling block on the way to promotion. You can directly give a spirit stone to buy it off. If you want to build a sect without resources, I will pave a spiritual path for you. There is nothing that cannot be solved with money, if there is, then use more money. Chapter 1 Infinite Spirit Stone System You are listening at NovelFull.audio Tian Fong is an earthling who accidentally fell off a cliff during a trip. However, he did not die, but his soul pierced into another world. This is called Tianwu World, and he traveled to a young man named Tian Fong. The original owner of the body is a disciple of the Hidden Corpse sect. Don't doubt it. By this name, you know it's not a legitimate sect, it's an authentic demon sect. He has been in this world called Tianwu for one year. During this year, he has to work as a factotum every day, which is very ground beetle. It's really hard. Can't you pass through a more powerful disciple? It's okay to have a little background. What kind of sect factotum is it? It's not pure ground beetle. Don't blame him for complaining, because the factotum disciples have to do heavy work every day. Not only that, the sect characteristic of the devil sect is that whoever has the biggest fist the final say. The weak have no rights so he is often bullied as a factotum disciple. Oda, I'll leave the work in the field to you today. I want to go out and have a good time, young master. The colleague who spoke was flipping his skin. My grass, can you do your job well on your own? Don't let me take care of it all day. Do you still have any sense of propriety, righteousness, and shame? Of course, this is just from the bottom of my heart. I can't say it on my lips, because he can't afford to turn things around. Although they are all lower-level disciples of the sect, there is also a distinction between high and low. For example, this flipping water has good fist and foot skills, which are enough to beat him completely. Don't worry, Brother Fan, I'm sure I'll do it beautifully for you, Tian Fong said with a smile. I admire you as a handsome person who knows the current affairs. When it comes to this skill within the sect, I also admire you, Tian Fong. Fan Pi Shui praised with a thumbs up. Tian Fong was about to cry and said, I'm not a handsome person, but I don't have the strength. If I could kill you, would I still have to do two jobs? Heaven, Earth, can't you pity me, a kind-hearted person? Tian Fong roared in his heart. It seemed that this sincerity moved heaven, and a sound of a machine turning on suddenly came to his mind. Didi, the infinite spirit stone system is activated, asking the host if it is bound. What, have you finally come to traverse the system? God has finally opened his eyes. Tian Fong shouted in his heart, Bind, give me a dead binding. When Tian Fong was on earth, he read many novels, and many of the protagonists who traveled through them had systematic help. Unexpectedly, this opportunity also fell on him. Let me take a look, the infinite spirit stone system. He thought briefly, there's nothing difficult to understand, just have as many spirit stones as you want. Thinking of this, Tian Feng's eyes gradually flickered with light, indicating that he is now the wealthiest person in the world. Is it because I have some wild ideas? He was a bit unsure, so he said, the system will first give me a hundred spirit stones to see. As a miscellaneous disciple, I work hard every month and only have a few spiritual stones. A hundred spiritual stones is already a considerable wealth. In an instant, a hundred spirit stones appeared in the warehouse of the system, no more, no less. Damn it, there really is. At this moment, Tian Feng's adrenal hormones were soaring, his eyes wide open, as if he had discovered something incredible. 
It's really an infinite spirit stone system. Feeling excited, Tian Fong was momentarily taken aback and seemed to have thought of something. There shouldn't be any restrictions, because other systems have many restrictions that need to be slowly unlocked as their strength improves. In order to test the limitations of the system, he had a sudden idea and shouted out a hundred thousand spirit stones. However, without any discount, one hundred thousand spirit stones immediately appeared in the system warehouse. The one hundred thousand spirit stones were piled up like a small mountain, emitting a huge spiritual energy and looking spectacular. This shocking force almost completely crushed Tian Fong. Wow, I'm advancing. Just by smelling the scent, Tian Fong advanced directly from the first level of gas refining to the second level of gas refining, and was instantly stunned on the spot. It's truly the Lingshir Mountain. You can level up even if you smell it, amazing. Tian Fong thought to himself, if I were to cultivate with so many Lingshir, my realm would not explode in minutes. The reason why he has been unable to improve his level is twofold. Firstly, his miscellaneous disciples do not have much resources, and secondly, his talent is really rubbish. The talent in the cultivation world mainly depends on the spiritual root, which is generally divided into five levels. Extremely inferior, inferior, intermediate, superior, and extremely superior. Unfortunately, Tian Fong is the spiritual root talent of extremely inferior, Otherwise he would not have done miscellaneous work in the sect. Good cultivation talents will soon be discovered by the sect, taken as disciples by the elders, and even sent to become true disciples. There will even be direct wars between sects to recruit a disciple with top dot quality talents, which shows how important talent is for cultivators. What about talent trash? With so many spirit stones to support it, are you still afraid of not being able to make a difference in cultivation? At this moment, Tian Feng's confidence exploded, and with money, his entire spirit and spirit became different. No, there are also grades in the spirit stones, including lower grade, medium grade, and upper grade. I'm not sure if the system can give some medium grade spirit stones. Thinking of this, his heart began to thump again because the value and rarity of mid to high grade spirit stones were higher, and their effects were even greater. If they could be directly given to mid to high grade spirit stones, the benefits would be unimaginable. The system will start with a thousand medium grade spirit stones. As soon as the words fell, a thousand medium grade spirit stones arrived in the system warehouse. These spirit stones were larger in size and contained stronger spiritual power, even emitting a dazzling light. Wow, my eyes. Tian Fong felt pain and quickly closed his eyes before exiting the warehouse, where the pile of intermediate spirit stones almost blinded him. Damn it, the realm is too low. A large number of medium-grade spirit stones can't even be seen, it's really torture. Tian Fong was a bit scared, but fortunately he didn't shout out a thousand high-dot-quality spirit stones directly. If he really shouted out, the treasure light of the spirit stones might have killed him directly. Tian Fong realized that with his current abilities, the lower grade spirit stones were sufficient, and the upper and middle grade spirit stones were used by experts for trading. Most cultivators still use the lower grade spirit stones. After having money, Tian Fang's arrogance surged and he immediately threw his hoe aside. Who is still working hard here when they have money? I am the chosen son of heaven. As soon as he thought about the oppression he received on a daily basis, he became angry and said, flip the water and wait for me. I'll get up and take care of you first. However, he is not the only one who bullies him on weekdays. This is the demon sect, and there are no virtuous men or women who believe in him. Thinking of this, Tian Fong went back and changed into clean clothes, and went directly to the neighborhood market where the sect was located at the foot of the mountain. If you ask him what he's going to do, then it's needless to say, it's just a matter of buying and selling. Let's go on a crazy shopping spree first. Chapter 2 Shanxiafang City You are listening at Novel Full.audio The market at the foot of the mountain is quite lively, 
and many monks stop here to buy the items they need. Because of this, there are a wide variety of shops in the neighborhood, and cultivators can basically buy whatever materials they need. Due to poverty, Tian Fong doesn't come to the local market much on weekdays. If he comes, he is just running errands for his senior brothers, acting as the legendary delivery runner. I finally don't have to help others run takeout today. I'm a big customer. Thinking so in his heart, his waist straightened a lot, and the saying goes that his wallet is bulging and his waist is strong. Will my upcoming shopping spree cause any trouble? If people who know me know about it, I'm sure they won't have any ulterior motives. Although Tian Foam was wealthy, he spent a year in the demon sect and developed a cautious personality. In addition, none of the disciples of the hidden corpse sect were fuel-efficient lamps, so he would never put himself in danger, otherwise his life would be in danger. It's best to disguise myself so that people don't recognize me. When Tian Fong thought of this, he suddenly saw a human skin mask at a roadside stall. The mask was exquisitely crafted and looked like a good thing. Boss, how do you sell this human skin mask? The vendor was a somewhat rough-looking man who was squatting on the stall selling things with a gloomy expression. Judging from the man's temperament, it was likely that he was also a demon cultivator. He is not the only one who dominates near the Tsangshir sect gate. There are also the magic puppet gate and the stove cauldron gate nearby. It can be said that each one is more ruthless, but they are not good things. 500 Spirit Stones the big man blurted out the price, which was not a small amount for the miscellaneous disciples. In the eyes of the big man, Tian Fong appeared too ordinary to afford. Five hundred spirit stones, so cheap. Tian Fong thought to himself. He has now transformed, no longer the petty laborer who is struggling, but a wealthy tycoon with a hundred thousand spirit stones in his pocket. Five hundred yuan is naturally nothing. Just as he was about to make the payment, his hand suddenly stopped because he didn't even blink and took out 500 spirit stones, which was too outrageous. It would be great if he were to be remembered by this big man. It's better to talk about the price. It's really troublesome. It seems that even wealthy people have troubles. So Tian Fong began his somewhat awkward acting skills, with a pained expression on his face, looking very uncomfortable. Because expressing the expression of wanting to buy while also lacking money requires some professional skills, after all, he did not study in the performance department of the film academy in his previous life. With 100,000 yuan in his pocket, he was about to show that he couldn't afford to eat, and Tian Fong was also feeling a lot of pain at the moment. Big brother, can you come down a bit and offer a 20% discount he tentatively said. No, I won't bargain here. This human skin mask can not only cover up the face but also hinder the cultivator's divine sense exploration. It is a top-dot-notch tool for disguising oneself. If it weren't for urgent need of money, I wouldn't be willing to sell it. Da Han seems to be really in a hurry to use money, and this attitude is not like pretending. If it is pretending, then his acting skills must be at the level of a bachelor's degree from a film academy. Damn it! This person's acting skills are a few blocks ahead of me. Tian Fong doesn't think this big guy is really short of money, he just wants to quickly sell items at a high price and use some small tricks. At this moment, Tian Fong was too lazy to continue acting with him. As an outsider, he was competing with someone who graduated from a prestigious university's performance department for acting skills. Isn't that asking for trouble on his own? Quickly pulling out 500 spirit stones, Tian Fong successfully took off the human skin mask. Hmm. Who is this? It doesn't seem like he's very wealthy. The big man looked at Tian Fong again, but didn't find any abnormalities. I guess taking out these 500 spirit stones has already emptied his wealth. The real price of this human skin mask is only 300 spirit stones, but the big man sold it for nearly twice the price, and at this time he is also satisfied. After finding a deserted place to wear a human skin mask, Tian Fong felt some sense of security, after all, now almost no one can recognize him. 
It feels really different to come out and mix in a different vest. It seems like I didn't do anything out of line. This feeling was quite overwhelming, and Tian Fong sighed and headed straight to the store. Although covered by a mask, Tian Fong still chose to enter Jubao Pavilion for shopping. Jubao Pavilion belongs to a neutral faction that only engages in business and has a good reputation. It has opened branches among various factions, and even Tian Fong, a miscellaneous disciple, knows about it, which shows its uniqueness. This Taoist friend wants to buy something. Our store operates with sincerity and we are honest with both the elderly and the young. Tian Fong was greeted by a graceful female cultivator. Hello sister, I want to buy a martial arts secret book and some cultivation materials. Tian Fong instantly showed a pig-like appearance, because the female cultivator she received was exquisitely dressed and indeed had a certain beauty. In fact, Tian Feng's luck is quite good. This woman is the manager of the branch here, named Chu Fei. She usually only receives large customers. Today, I happened to meet her and ended up doing this business. Chu Fei didn't show any disdain when she saw the other person's face, which was a pig-like expression. As a qualified salesperson, this basic literacy is not a problem. Moreover, her appearance is indeed somewhat outstanding, and it is reasonable for others to have such reactions. I don't know what kind of martial arts secrets friends want. Tian Fong pondered for a moment, and his favorite was naturally the graceful sword cultivator. The graceful feeling of walking with a sword in a white robe was really handsome. He dreamed of becoming such a cultivator one day. No way, if I really wear a white robe and walk with a sword, looking like a swordsman, I will soon be mistaken by the people of the sect for an undercover agent sent by a prestigious and righteous sect. I will be expelled from the righteous sect and I don't know how to die. Tian Fong immediately rejected this idea. The image of the white-clothed sword immortal is suitable in other places, but in the demon sect, it's already a dead end. If you don't have any scars on your face or tattoos on your body, it's embarrassing to say that you came out of the demon sect. Although I don't have any tattoos or wounds, I still need to wear a dark-colored outfit to look like I'm wearing black gas. Dao Yu. Chu Fei looked at Tian Fong in a daze and didn't know what he was thinking. She called out softly. Tian Fong quickly turned around, feeling a bit embarrassed, and then said, I want a magic technique. Although you can't become a white-clad sword immortal, becoming a black-clad sword demon is definitely not a problem. The magic technique. Chu Fei smiled and then said, I think there are some basic magic techniques that are more suitable for my Taoist friend's cultivation. Then she took out a magic book called The Hidden Corpse Technique from the counter. This is the core skill of the Tsangshir sect. When cultivated to a great extent, one can control a hundred-year-old zombie, which is very powerful. I don't know what Taoist friends think. Chapter 3 Purple Cloth Poisonous Sword Cultivation You are listening at NovelFull.audio Seeing the secret script of the Hidden Corpse sect prominently located in the counter, Tian Fong was immediately surprised. This is the core skill of the sect, which can only be practiced by inner disciples. These miscellaneous workers don't even have the qualification to take a glance, but they didn't expect the complete version to appear in the treasure-gathering pavilion. It seemed that she could see Tian Feng's thoughts, and Chu Fei explained, not only are the teachings of the Hidden Corpse sect, but also the core inheritances of the Magic Puppet sect and the Dinglu sect are sold here. Our Jubao Pavilion is very powerful. Chu Fei is absolutely right. In terms of strength, the Jubao Pavilion may still be higher than the three major demon sections. However, the Jubao Pavilion only does business and does not pose a threat to other forces. Otherwise, the three sects would not allow other forces to infiltrate. The techniques of the Hidden Corpse sect are indeed good, but I cannot learn them, Tian Fong thought to himself. If someone finds out, there is a suspicion of stealing a teacher. In fact, Tian Fong was very right. In the Hidden Corpse sect, the charge of stealing a teacher is very serious. 
In order to avoid misunderstandings, he cannot learn. As for the other two sects, they are also not allowed, because a miscellaneous disciple who knows the martial arts of other sects can easily be mistaken for an insider. If I were misunderstood and killed, wouldn't I be even more unjust than Do E? Tian Feng shook his head, not interested in these secret scripts. Then why not try this book, Frog God Technique, which can acquire the ability of Frog God and has very strong combat power. Chu Fei continued to introduce, however, when one reaches a great level of cultivation, the image of a cultivator may shift towards that of a Frog God. Frog God Tian Feng was momentarily taken aback and immediately understood. Isn't this just relying on toad skill? My grass is so elegant, and I dare to use the word God in the secret book of the Qi refining period. I don't know what the senior who wrote this book thought. Tian Feng was speechless. His wish was to shape himself into a graceful image of a white clothed sword immortal. If he had practiced this technique, wouldn't it be like a white clothed toad standing on top of a flying sword? Not to mention being graceful, it would be good if people didn't laugh off his big teeth. No, no. Tian Feng quickly waved his hand, looking very disgusted. Do you have any more handsome techniques? Handsome. Chu Fei was momentarily taken aback, and then understood what the client was thinking. She said, I don't know if this five poisons technique meets the taste of a Taoist friend. Why haven't I heard of the five poisons technique? Dot. Tian Feng asked. The five poisons technique is the inheritance of another demon sect, the five poisons sect. However, the five poisons sect is relatively far away from the hidden corpse sect, and people here know very little about it, which is reasonable. After listening to the explanation, Tian Feng's heart was moved. There was no entanglement of interests in a relatively distant area, and the probability of being identified as a spy was not high. It looked quite good and from the name, it was known that it was a poisonous Tao technique with considerable killing power. Okay, that's it. Tian Feng took a brief glance and realized that the secret script requires the cultivation of the five toxins of snakes, toads, centipedes, scorpions, and geckos. Through cultivation, these five toxins are blended together to form a poison sac that belongs to the cultivator's own body, wrapped in spiritual energy. During battles, it can release its toxins, which can be said to be unstoppable. Of course, it is not possible to practice the five poisons technique without toxins, so Tian Feng went straight to the point and bought the basic toxins of the five toxins to cooperate with his own cultivation. After putting away the cultivation method and the bottle filled with toxins, Tian Feng felt a surge of joy in his heart. This way of shopping, there's nothing to say, just a word, it's refreshing. Oh, by the way, I also need some magic tools. I thought the transaction would come to an end, but I didn't expect Tian Feng to make a new request. Oh, I don't know what magic tool friends need. Chu Fei was also somewhat surprised at this moment, because the young man had already consumed a thousand spirit stones and now he still wanted to buy them, indicating that he carried a lot of spirit stones, either rich or expensive. This is the hidden corpse sect. Is it the blood relatives of the sect elders? Chu Fei was confused. She has some understanding of the major elders of the hidden corpse sect, and can't really think of which elders' blood relatives or direct disciples they are. Of course, Chu Fei was just speculating. There were also some casual cultivators and external forces who came to the neighborhood to consume, not necessarily people from the corpse clan. It was reasonable for him not to think of them. I need a long sword, preferably black, and also a self-defense tool. The price is reasonable, but the main thing is good quality. Tian Feng expressed his request to walk in the cultivation world. Without some tools in his hands, it is definitely not possible. In the past, the price of such magical tools was very expensive, and it was not something that a miscellaneous disciple could touch. However, today it is different. Later, Chu Fei recommended the black crystal sword, golden silk soft armor, 
and wisteria Taoist robe to him. These magical tools were rare for disciples during the Qi refining period, and now he has bought them all. The black crystal sword is made of spiritual iron and contains a spiritual material called black crystal, which not only increases the strength of the sword but also better matches the spiritual power of the cultivator the defense of golden soft armor is very strong, able to block a lot of weapon damage. As for the wisteria robe, it is even more powerful. It can not only resist some spell attacks, but also automatically clean and adjust body temperature. The most important thing is low.key, luxurious, and meaningful, simple but not simple. Although Tian Feng is the richest man in the Tianwu world, his current strength is very weak, so it's better to keep a low profile. If he doesn't develop enough, he will be killed by being fucked. Isn't it a big trick to slip the world? Give me another swordsmanship, combined with this five poisons technique, Tian Feng said. Later, Chu Fei recommended a sword technique called Jiao De Yi Jian Shu to him. This sword technique is cunning and easy to defend against. After a brief glance at the sword manual, Tian Feng exclaimed, You are indeed a group of cunning people. This swordsmanship does not seek to kill, but rather to harm. It is most suitable for the five poisons technique because it can be used to poison a sword. As long as it can harm the enemy, they will definitely be unable to bear it. After some operation, Tian Feng felt as if he had become a purple clothed poison sword cultivator, which seemed a bit different from the fairy image he had imagined. Dao Yu spent a total of 3,000 spirit stones on this shopping trip. When Chu Fei said these words, she smiled very brightly. This is a considerable number, not to mention for cultivators during the Qi refining period, not everyone has so much savings even during the foundation building period. 3,000 spirit stones, although many, are just a drop in the bucket for me. Tian Feng felt no waves in his heart, even thinking it was a bit cheap. However, as a low dot level disciple of Qi refining, spending so much at once was quite frightening. It's still the old rule, first cut the price and perform it to avoid arousing suspicion. Tian Feng had no choice but to showcase his amateur performance skills and put on a painful expression, saying, can we offer a discount? Chapter 4 The Five Poisons Technique You are listening at NovelFull.audio Tian Feng didn't know why, but when he said these words, his face turned red for no reason. Chu Fei explained with a smile, I'm really sorry, there is no bargaining power in our Jubao Pavilion. We can sell the treasures for as much as they are priced. Her meaning is very clear, 3,000 spirit stones, not a single penny can be missing. Although the requirements were very strict, Tian Feng's heart was filled with joy. That's right, it would be great not to bargain. It saves me the need to learn an actor's self-cultivation, so that everyone can enjoy it. This is 3,000 spirit stones, take a look, right. Tian Feng threw out a storage bag with a very straightforward gesture, and he likes the store to follow these rules. Originally, Chu Fei thought the other party was going to procrastinate, but she didn't expect to make the payment immediately. At first glance, it was indeed 3,000 spirit stones. That's right, I don't know if you're a disciple of the Tsangshir sect. Seeing that Tian Feng was very young, yet so generous in his actions, most likely someone with status, Chu Fei couldn't help but ask for a moment of curiosity. Oh, should we also inquire about the origin of Jubao Pavilion shopping now? Tian Feng put on an unhappy expression. Chu Fei quickly explained, Daoist friend misunderstood. When we do business at Jubao Pavilion, we never ask about our customers' backgrounds. It's just that I think Daoist friend is very friendly, so I just want to get to know him. Kind, get to know each other. Tian Feng sneered inwardly, damn it, you're trying to dig my bottom. How could you see through my secrets? I'm just a casual cultivator. I've been wandering here lately, not a cultivator of the hidden corpse sect. Tian Feng quickly fabricated an identity, but he didn't want to expose it and get into trouble. I see. 
Chu Fei nodded and said, Jubao Pavilion has many treasures and a good reputation. If you have any needs, feel free to let me know and we will do our best to meet them. Chu Fei didn't want to offend the wealthy cultivator in front of her. She quickly changed the topic and greeted him with a smile, with an expression that you were a VIP and you were God. Well, I will come and take care of your business more often. Looking at the sales lady who was quite sensible, Tian Feng nodded and said, if you have money to earn, who would be unable to get along with the god of wealth? Tian Feng immediately left the Jubao Pavilion. In fact, he could buy more supplies, but in the early stages of qi refining, it was already unbelievable to sell 3,000 spirit stones. If it was too outrageous, it would not be good. Everything needs to be done step by step, as the saying goes, you can't get fat with just one bite. Although Chu Fei was eager to know his identity, considering the rules of Jubao Pavilion, she could only give up. After all, Jubao Pavilion only attracts countless businesses without seeking the bottom line. Once this rule is broken, its reputation will be ruined. Who will come here to shop in the future? Continuing to stroll around the neighborhood, Tian Feng didn't return to his small wooden house until evening. There is only one kerosene lamp in the room, and Tian Feng is currently burning the lamp to read at night, experiencing the mysteries of the Five Poisons technique. Originally, in order to practice this Five Poisons technique, it was necessary to blend the toxins of the five toxins together to form a toxin that belonged to the cultivation of toxins. As he realized, every person who practices this technique forms a new toxin that is different, and generally only the practitioner can unlock it. To detoxify through medical techniques, it is only possible if the doctor's level is extremely high. However, this method is easy to cultivate and requires a lot of mana to fuse toxins. Otherwise, one needs to be familiar with the properties of toxins and skillfully fuse them. Tian Feng's understanding is correct. Generally, disciples of the Five Poisons sect will be exposed to and raised with various toxins from the beginning of cultivation. Their bodies have already developed basic anti-toxicity skills, and they have a deep understanding of toxins through their habit of learning them. Only by practicing with magic can they achieve success. I'm not familiar with toxins, and my body doesn't have much resistance to them. However, I have a lot of spirit stones and unlimited mana. I'll just rely on you and see who can withstand them. Tian Feng no longer hesitated at this moment, as tens of thousands of spirit stones appeared around him in an instant. The spiritual energy emanating from the spirit stones gave people a feeling of pleasure like drinking a sweet spring. Ah, it's comfortable. Tian Feng snorted, why do disciples want to enter the inner gate to practice? It's simple because the inner gate has abundant spiritual energy, but the spiritual energy around me now is so much stronger than the inner gate. Feeling the immense spiritual energy, Tian Feng instantly felt that the inner door that he had previously wanted to break his head into was no longer fragrant. He first drank a bottle of snake venom into his mouth, then wrapped it in spiritual energy, operated the technique, and tried to combine the toxin with his body, but the two immediately experienced an aversion reaction. I rubbed it, and my body felt like a knife-twisting pain. This snake venom is so powerful. Tian Feng was greatly surprised. Practicing poison skills is a very dangerous thing, and if he was not careful, he would burp his butt. Previously, the cultivators of the Five Poisons cult who practiced poison skills died, and even if he was prepared, he did not expect it to be so dangerous. Give me a suck. Tian Fengxi spared no expense in inhaling a large amount of spiritual energy into his body. The spiritual energy, like a police officer maintaining order, organized these disorderly toxins and allowed them to operate according to their work routes, gradually merging with his body, thus solving the risk of toxin backlash. Fortunately, I have a lot of spirit stones, otherwise this cultivation will soon see the king of hell. After stabilizing, Tian Feng wiped the sweat off his forehead and continued to take the second bottle of scorpion poison, using the same method to blend it with his body. After his second experience, everything went much smoother. 
Tian Feng clearly saw a magical poison sac forming inside his body. Whenever his magical power passed through the poison sac, it would carry a touch of poison, causing him to kill invisibly. This is the strength of the poison technique. Taking five types of poisons in sequence, the five poisons technique can be said to be beginner's level. This kind of poison technique is difficult to enter, and once you enter, your cultivation will be much easier. As long as you have enough toxins and spirit stones, you can gradually improve your own level. Time passed quickly as he started practicing, and now the sky was gradually brightening. Unconsciously, he had been practicing all night. Isn't that right? Ten thousand spirit stones are gone like this. Looking at the shattered spirit stones on the ground, his expression looked a bit confused. This is ten thousand spirit stones. Even cultivators during the foundation building period rarely have so much money, not to mention a refining period. Consuming a large amount of spirit stones is not without effect. Tian Feng reached the third level of qi refining cultivation in one night, which can be said to be a rapid progress in a sense. In fact, when practicing other methods, it is impossible to consume 10,000 spirit stones in the third layer of qi refining. However, all the excess spiritual power is used by him to suppress toxins at no cost, combined with the talent of garbage, which has consumed so much. My lowest level talent is really scumbag. When 10,000 spirit stones reach the third level of qi refining, I blush even when I say it. Tian Feng's face involuntarily moved and his face turned slightly black. But it doesn't matter, anyway, the spirit stone is infinite, whatever you want, he said later, Tian Feng appeared indifferent and practiced the five poisons technique overnight, which was unprecedented and unprecedented. Even the holy sons and daughters in the five poisons sect probably did not have this cultivation speed, because they could not have so many spiritual stones to consume casually. Just as Tian Feng was proud and showing a pig's smile, the wooden door was kicked open by someone, and the person scolded and said, Damn Tian Feng, what did I ask you to do? Chapter 5 Breaking Hand Bones You are listening at NovelFull.audio The door panel of the wooden house was kicked off directly, and it wasn't anyone else who came in to curse, it was the flipping water who always bullied people. Tian Feng, do you want to die his mother? Yesterday I asked you to pull out all the weeds in my field, why hasn't there been any change in the field this morning, said flipping water, thrusting out the big cake face originally, Tian Feng was so angry that he couldn't help but listen attentively. When it came to anger, he even got two slaps, but now it's different from before. He is already a cultivator with three levels of qi refining, while the opponent is only one level of qi refining, the difference is really too big. Flip the water and take care of your spiritual field yourself. Why should I contribute? At this moment, Tian Feng became more forceful in his speech and said, I was just helping you out as a fellow disciple. You thought you were so amazing. Yoho, you've grown up and even dared to challenge me. Today, I'll let you know what cruelty is. Flipping the skin and getting angry, I don't know why. The previously docile waste suddenly started to fall apart today. If we don't give it some color to show, it's not worth it. Although flipping water is also the lowest level cultivation talent and is currently a cultivator who trains qi, he has not learned some martial arts before he started, so he can always beat Tian Feng to pieces. Faced with Tian Feng's lack of face and no hesitation in turning the tables, he swung his sword and swung it out. With a strong martial arts background, this strike was enough to cut a brick and stone. However, Tian Feng has made significant progress. At this moment, looking at the martial arts that he cannot deal with on a daily basis, he is truly vulnerable and weak. Just a gentle slap deflected the powerful hand knife, and not only that, the tremendous force passed down his arm and onto flipping water's body, causing his body to comically rotate in place before falling to the ground with unstable steps. Hmm. What's going on? The flipping water on the ground was a bit confused at the moment, and he didn't even realize why Tian Feng was so powerful today. 
Kid, you've taken a big pill. That thing's not good for your health. How dare you eat it? Flipping the skin and thinking simply, I believe that Tian foam was only so strong after taking medicine. Dili Wan is a type of pill that overdraws the body and then becomes very strong in a short period of time. After taking it, it can have tremendous strength. However, this medicine has a great effect and if taken too much, it is easy to paralyze. Therefore, without any accidents, few people are willing to take it. Could it be that it's not my fault, but rather your recent excessive indulgence and physical weakness? Tian Fong joked, because he noticed that there were still some powder colors on the neck of the flipped skin water. It is estimated that he had been busy on the belly of some old woman all night last night. After hearing these words, he flipped his head and tightened his pants. His emotions were complex, and he was indeed a bit flustered when someone said something important. Shouldn't I really be empty? I can't even clean up a piece of garbage. Flipping water began to doubt himself, because during this period, he had indeed indulged in excessive indulgence. The whole night's entertainment not only emptied his wallet, but also greatly reduced his physical fitness. With a knife at the beginning of the color character, even a strong warrior is no exception, but after thinking for a moment, I realized it was not right. Are you fooling me? It's a small matter to deal with you even if you are empty. In order to verify his suspicions, Fanpi Shue made another move, and with just one punch, he was giving it his all. If it were Tian Fong before him, he would probably be defeated by this punch. But now, there's really no threat. He also punched hard, only heard a click, and without any accidents, his flipping wrist just broke off. My sore throat was about to burst, and the pain of breaking my wrist was unbearable. However, as I watched Tian Fong stand up, his shouting suddenly came to an end, and deep fear filled my heart. Without waiting for Tian Fong to take action, Fan Pishue suppressed the pain and ran away. If caught, his life might not be guaranteed, and he is not a fool. Let's save his life first. In fact, Tian Fong has already had a murderous heart. If he really takes action, how can the flipping water escape? It's just that he openly kills people in the sect, and this punishment is still relatively heavy. Killing him may be a bit troublesome, it's best to find time to break through to the fourth level of gas refining, and it would be better to pass the assessment and enter the outer door. The first level disciples of the Tsangshir sect who practice Qi belong to the miscellaneous level, while the second to third levels belong to the outer gate. Once they reach the fourth level of Qi training, they can enter the inner gate. As long as you enter the inner gate, your identity will be one head higher than that of this kind of miscellaneous disciple. When you come across him, you will have to bow, and it will be much more convenient to make a move. At this moment, the flipping water dared not stop and ran outside with all its might, afraid of being caught up and silenced, until it ran a long distance and finally stopped panting. This bastard even took a big pill to prank me, not afraid of the side effects of the pill. The flipped surface showed a look of hatred, if you dare to break my wrist, you will have to pay the price. He is also considered a prominent figure among the miscellaneous disciples, and now he has been beaten up like this by a useless person. How can he continue to behave? Quickly, the corners of the flipping water spout turned upwards and came up with a good idea. Originally, Tian Fong had to work in Ling Tian during the day, but now his strength is different from before, and he no longer needs to engage in that kind of heavy physical labor. It was important to advance to the fourth level of qi refining, so I closed the door again and held the spirit stone in my hand inside the room, meditating and practicing. It wasn't until the afternoon that the door of the room was knocked on. Brother Tian, are you inside? The speaker's name is Su Fei, who is also a miscellaneous disciple and has a good relationship with Tian Fong on weekdays. Oh, how could he come to me? Tian Fong opened the door and said, Shouldn't you be in the field? Why did you come to me? Su Fei looked anxious and said, It's not good, Brother Tian. The spiritual field you're in charge of has been ruined by someone. Steward who is getting angry and is coming to you now. 
Tian Feng understood what was going on as soon as he heard it, mostly because of this mischievous water. In fact, he guessed it right. In the morning, Pai Pai Shui recovered from his injuries and secretly ruined Tian Feng's spiritual field while everyone went back to eat at noon. If the spiritual field is damaged, the responsible servants will be punished, not only beaten but also compensated, which is simply a punishment that the servants cannot afford. Tian Feng thought that after being injured by himself, the flipping water would subside a bit in the near future, but he didn't expect the revenge to come so quickly. I originally wanted you to live a few more days, but since you're looking for death, I'll send you home today. At this moment, Tian Feng was also a bit annoyed, but he said calmly on the surface, I know. I'll go over in a while, you go back first. Su Fei sighed and could only turn his head to leave, as he couldn't be of much help either. Tian Feng tidied up his clothes and walked straight to Ling Tian. Chapter 6 Steward Husan. You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. On the Ling Tian, Husan was sitting on the Grand Tutor's chair waiting for Tian Feng's arrival. Standing next to him was the flipping water with a bandaged board wrapped in one hand. Seeing Tian Feng's arrival, Fan Pishue smiled with a cunning and successful scheme. Stinky kid, I'll see how you end up now. The spirit field is the life of the miscellaneous servant disciples. If the spirit field is finished, the responsible disciples will also be ruined. This is the rule of miscellaneous servants. The Ling Tian outside the gate is divided into more than ten areas, and Hu San is in charge of one area, which can be said to be the highest leader of this area. At this moment, Hu San was lying comfortably, and when Tian Feng arrived, he didn't even bother to lift his eyelids. Another worker was peeling the walnut for him, looking very comfortable. Tian Feng, when you see Hu Guanxer, why can't you be polite? Aren't you taking Ling Tian Guanxer seriously anymore? As soon as Fan Pishue met, he set a trap for Tian Feng and drew hatred, hoping that Hu San could execute him Ling Qi. Flipping water, I let you go in the morning. I thought you would calm down for a while, but I didn't expect to come and cause trouble in the afternoon. Why, your wrist doesn't hurt anymore. Flipping water's face instantly became gloomy as he remembered the shame of the morning. What kind of skill is it to take a big pill? You have the guts. Wait until my wrist is good and I'll have a one dot on point one fight. Single choice. You think you're the leader of Causeway Bay, I'm afraid you won't survive today. Tian Feng said with a disdainful expression, using his three-legged martial arts skills like flipping water. He could now kill him at any time. Hu San originally thought that when Tian Feng arrived, he would immediately kneel down and beg for mercy. He showed great compassion and hit him thirty times, writing a IOU of one hundred spirit stones to complete the task. I didn't expect the always weak waste to become hard, which made him very unhappy. On this one acre and three fun land, no one dared to disobey his orders. Hmm. Husan opened his eyes, slowly stood up, and said with a cold expression, Tian Feng, you are really too reckless today. Not only did you not guard the spiritual field well, but you were also arrogant in front of me. Who gave you the courage? Watching Hu San come forward, flipping his skin and quickly stepping forward to add oil and vinegar, he said, Steward Hu, I think this guy is just unhappy with you. He deliberately damaged the spirit field and wanted revenge. You can't spare him. Originally, Hu San's pressure was quite heavy, because he had a cultivation level of three levels of qi, which was indeed difficult to compete with a miscellaneous worker who had only one level of qi. However, Tian Feng is currently also a cultivation in the third level of gas refining, so this kind of pressure has disappeared. Hu Guanxer, how could the spiritual field that I have worked hard to plant be damaged for no reason? Besides, I have to bear the responsibility for the destruction of the spiritual field, so I am not the one who ruined this field. Tian Feng calmly analyzed and said, in the morning, he turned around and caused trouble, but I cleaned up the mess. I'm afraid this spiritual field was destroyed by him. He briefly explained his grudges against the flipping water, 
as long as his intelligence is not compromised, he can know the tricks behind it. After hearing this, Hussein glanced at the flipping water next to him, with a hint of reproach in his eyes. It was generally clear that this was mostly done by flipping water. The flipping water is now urgent. If the fire burns on his head, wouldn't it be like lifting a stone and smashing his own feet? Hu Guanshir, you can't listen to him talk nonsense, it's just a bloody mouth. Since I said it was done, do you have any evidence? If you don't, it's a false accusation. I will definitely charge you with the crime of false accusation, Fan Pishue pointed at Tian Feng and shouted although I know that this matter was done through flipping the surface, Tian Feng's performance today made this steward somewhat dissatisfied. It's impolite to see me, and it doesn't seem to be afraid of me. If you don't show him some color, you might think that I, as a caretaker tiger, don't show off and treat him like a sick cat. Hussein must maintain his authority on this acre of land, so no matter what, he must give this worker some color to see. Tian Feng, since you said this was done through flipping the surface, is there any evidence? Hussein said with a displeased expression on his face. There is no evidence. Tian Feng still spoke confidently, is Hu Guanxiu asking so to punish me? Seeing Tian Feng questioning himself, Hu San's anger surged. He had always been respected by his enslaved disciples, and this was the first person who was not afraid of him. I see you have itchy skin, you need to clean up. Hu San gave a glance, and the two miscellaneous disciples came with ill intentions, intending to show this ignorant young man some color. Even Hu Guanji dares to contradict, I see you don't want to live anymore. Two miscellaneous disciples, one on the left and one on the right, took action simultaneously, preparing to severely injure this ignorant guy. Unexpectedly, before their fists touched Tian Fong, they were already hit, each punched in the chest and fell to the ground groaning. Hmm. Hussein felt something was wrong when he saw this and said, it seems that your child's cultivation has improved. Hu Guanxiu, he should have taken another powerful pill. With his trash talent, it's impossible for him to be promoted to the second level of qi refining. Flipping the skin water himself is the lowest level talent, and naturally knows that this talent is very useless to cultivate. Since he is not good at it, let alone Tian Feng, who has always been submissive. Dali Maru Hu Sanyi pondered, eating too much of this kind of thing is not afraid of turning into a paralyzed person. Flipping water is afraid of the powerful pill, but Hu San is not afraid. He has a genuine three-dot-layer cultivation of qi cultivation, and can be said to have the highest strength in this area. A powerful pill cannot make up for the gap in cultivation. It seems like I haven't taken any action for a long time. Can't even control my own little brothers. Let's take a look at my ability to fly and escape without leaving any legs. After speaking, Hussan's body exploded with anger. As he liked to wear tight-fitting clothes, his clothes were instantly stretched out under the swelling of his muscles. The scattered true energy separated the clothes and shot out, revealing his robust muscles. No, what a sturdy body. Tian Feng was a bit dumbfounded at the moment. How did he achieve such a strong aura, and his huge muscles caught up with the fitness coach in the gym? At this moment, Tian Feng was a bit stunned, not knowing if he was a match. Hu San's previous accumulated strength was still in his heart, and he felt a bit guilty when he really challenged him. Wah, wah. No legs left. I saw Hu San jump onto the field ridge with a single arrow step, giving off a feeling of standing out from the crowd. His right leg swung left and right, as if there were shadows appearing, which looked very mysterious, as if he had used some top-dot-notch technique, making people feel intimidated. Undoubtedly, he is the steward of Ling Tian. He does have some skills. Stinky kid, he actually disobeyed the steward who, purely playing with fire. Flipping over the water, he was instantly uplifted at this moment. He could already see Tian Feng lying on the ground crying and calling out for his mother when he was about to be beaten. Those who offended him would never have a good ending. Tian Feng was nervous in his heart, 
and he never expected Hu San to be so strong. His body instinctively retreated, instinctively protecting his body with one hand and punching back with the other, shouting to strengthen his courage. Don't come over. The fists and feet intersected, and it was surprising that Hu San, who seemed invincible, was directly thrown into the sky by Tian Feng's casual punch. Chapter 7 The King of Proximity You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Hu San was punched and flew into the sky, which was not as simple as one or two meters. He was beaten to a height of more than ten meters. Then he made a free fall descent and with just a click, he landed on the ground like a flying ball. After lying on the ground, my body was still convulsing vigorously, and feces and urine flowed out. Being beaten like this, I couldn't survive. At this moment, the flipping water beside him was almost staring out of his eyes. He had no idea that this would result in Husan, the almost invincible steward in the spiritual field, being instantly killed by his subordinates. Not only the flipping water, but even Tian Fong found it somewhat unbelievable. I was so worried about his mother because of my strength, big muscles, and no legs. There is actually a reason why Hu San is so vulnerable. Firstly, his status in the sect is not high, and he still learns the lowest level of qi refining techniques. Secondly, Tian Feng's strength is relatively strong, and the cultivation accumulated from tens of thousands of spirit stones is not impressive. Looking at Hu San lying on the ground, Tian Feng felt a little curious. As the steward of Ling Tian, there should be something good about him. I took off my storage bag and took a look. What caught my eye were some lingerie and other items of the female cultivator, which made me blush. I didn't expect this guy to have the same moral character as flipping over water. Maybe the two of them have been discussing that kind of thing together, no wonder they helped him with this. There are still some spirit stones in the storage bag, which are currently the least favored by Tian Fong. It can be said that there are as many as needed. These are Two secret books No legs left and explosive cheat dot Tian Fong picked it up and gave it a brief glance. In fact, it wasn't that awkward, it was just that Hu San didn't cultivate enough. You can simply learn from it. So, when I thought of this, I put away two secret books. Just as he was putting away the secret script, his eyes suddenly saw another storage bag. Oh, why are there two storage bags? Tian Fong looked at it again and showed a surprised expression. He didn't expect that there were thousands of grains stored inside. Although the Ling Tian steward is a petty official, he can't help but have a lot of wealth. Tian Fong didn't expect Hu San to make so much profit during his years in office. Kill manager Hu, you're done. I'll go tell the supervisor now, and you'll wait for the strict punishment from the sect rules. At this moment, the flipping water woke up with a start. The crime of killing the steward was quite serious. Once the supervisor found out, he could be punished on the spot, or maybe he would be killed directly. How dare you report it? I haven't even taken out my hand to deal with you yet. Tian Feng's eyes gleamed with coldness. This guy didn't know how to restrain himself, but he caused trouble twice. If he didn't get rid of it, he might even cause bigger trouble. At this moment, the flipping water strengthened its courage and rushed towards it with all its might, looking like it was desperately trying. I didn't expect senior brother flipped water to be so tough. Even if he dies, he will avenge Hu Guanxer, Su Fei thought to himself, showing a look of admiration and admiration. However, before this admirable expression could disappear, Flipper Water's knees softened and he fell to the ground with a thud. As his body was still forward, he knelt down and slid in front of Tian Fong, holding onto his thighs and crying. Tian Junior Brother, I was confused this time. Please spare me this time. Senior brother, please. This sudden scene not only shocked Su Fei, but even frightened Tian Fong. If you can't fight, kneel down. This is too straightforward. Originally, Tian Fong wanted to tidy up his flipping water properly, but he didn't expect him to kneel down directly. 
His fist was stuck in mid-air and he didn't know if he should hit it. However, just as Tian Fong was stunned, a fierce expression suddenly appeared on his flipped face, and at some point, a bright dagger appeared in his hand. I'm nicknamed the King of Proximity. No matter how powerful you are, once you get close to me, it's a word of death. The technique of kneeling, begging for mercy, and turning into a despicable assassin in the martial arts world, with the help of flipping the skin and water, has killed countless opponents. It is now very skillful and extremely skilled. This move startled Tian Fong and he said, My grass, you can still be so shameless. However, the dagger was already within reach, and it was too late to dodge. However, Tian Fong is not panicked because he also has a Taoist robe and soft armor, which are specifically designed for self-defense. It may not be easy for others to harm him. As expected, when the dagger was stabbed onto the Taoist robe, it was strongly hindered, and no matter how hard he tried, he could not move forward by half a point. What, wearing inner armor? Flipping water instantly understood, but now it was too late to stop and escape because Tian Feng's attack had already arrived. Flipping water felt a piercing pain in his face, and his whole body was slapped and flew far away, lying on the ground unable to get up. At this moment, there was a noticeable five-finger mark on his face, which was purple-black and a sign of poisoning. That's right, Tian Feng, in a fit of rage, mixed his mana with a hint of poison and hit the flipping water face. Even if he couldn't kill the person with this slap, he would still be poisoned to death. The poison in the five poisons technique is not a joke. If there is no corresponding detoxification method, even a cultivator during the foundation building period will be killed. I was careless, I gave my opponent a chance to counterattack. It seems that I am still too young. The demon sect naturally has its own survival rules, and in order to survive better, these disciples have used every means possible. Today, flipping the water can be considered as a vivid lesson for Tian Fong. The two miscellaneous disciples who were starting to be knocked down in the distance were now frightened to the point where their liver and gallbladder were torn apart. They never dreamed that the usual submissive person would suddenly become so powerful, so they fled to the distance. If you want to run, it's not that easy. The two of them are Husan's confidants and even the thugs. If it weren't for Tian Feng's tricks, they would probably have been killed by these two today. The black flying sword was released and shot at the two at lightning speed. Only two chest-piercing sounds were heard, and the two miscellaneous disciples died under his sword. Ah! Su Fei, who was standing beside him, showed a look of fear upon seeing this. It seemed that Tian Feng wanted to kill people, silence their mouths, and destroy their bodies. Looking at Su Fei's panicked expression, Tian Feng smiled and said, Don't be nervous, I won't take action against you. Su Fei, like Tian Feng, is a scapegoat among the miscellaneous disciples. The relationship between the two is good, and they are even more from the same hometown, so they will not be completely eliminated. Tian Feng, if you kill these four people, there may be an accident. The external supervisor will not let such things go unchecked. Su Fei said with some concern, why don't you take advantage of this time to escape? Escape. Where are we going? Tian Feng is well aware that with his current cultivation level, it is basically impossible for him to step out of the influence range of the hidden corpse sect. It seems that the only way to improve one's cultivation is as soon as possible. Chapter 8 Lipey Toad You are listening at NovelFull.audio Tian Feng returned to his residence afterwards, while Su Fei wisely buried the bodies of the four people in the spiritual field, using them as fertilizer, which was considered a deserved death. After practicing in the room for three days, Tian Feng clearly felt that the speed of cultivation had slowed down. The advantage of this five poisons technique is that there are no bottlenecks. As long as there are sufficient resources, it can elevate the realm. However, it requires not only spirit stones, but also more five poisons and toxins. Tian Feng stopped meditating, feeling that his cultivation speed had noticeably slowed down. In theory, 
he had an infinite spiritual stone that could quickly reach the middle stage of qi cultivation. However, after three days of cultivation, his progress was very slow. In fact, practicing other martial arts is the same. To quickly cultivate, one must have sufficient resources, and the other is to have a high level of understanding. The five poisons technique does not require high levels of comprehension, but rather high levels of toxins, which also demonstrates that it is not easy to cultivate a good martial art. It seems that we still need to go down the mountain to the city center. Tian Fong felt that improving his cultivation was imminent because three of his miscellaneous disciples had died, and the fact that one of the steward had died could not be kept hidden for long. Although these four people have already been silenced by him, they can't contain the fire. There will always be a little exposure, and if their cultivation is too low, they will suffer. Although he really wanted to hide at home and absorb spiritual energy, he had to go to the local market one by one again. Wearing a mask of good skin, Tian Fong once again arrived at the Jibao Pavilion. Chu Fei saw Tian Fong arriving at a glance and approached with a smile to greet him. Do you still like the treasure you purchased last time? The treasures in Jubao Pavilion do indeed have quality assurance, otherwise Chu Fei wouldn't have asked such a question. Obviously, she has confidence in her own things. It's quite satisfactory. Tian Fong said lightly. Satisfying me, if it weren't for my abundant spiritual stones, I would have died under this cultivation method a long time ago. This five poisons technique is really unfriendly for beginners in the poison sect. Without experiencing it in the five poisons cult, they start practicing it immediately and have a high probability of being poisoned to death. If you don't understand martial arts, don't recommend them randomly, it will harm you. Of course, this is just Tian Feng's inner thoughts, and he cannot say it verbally. After all, even a salesperson cannot be familiar with various techniques. Do you have any other needs when you come to our store this time? Chu Fei asked somewhat puzzled, logically speaking, he should still be practicing after buying the Dharma technique. He shouldn't come back so soon. Ah, the toxins from last time were taken away by our elders. Come and buy more this time. Tian Fong dare not say that all the toxins have been used up. The speed is somewhat frightening, and it can only be said that he was taken by the elders of the clan, which metaphorically implies that he is a person with a background. Oh, it's easy to say. I'll go get it for my Taoist friend right away. Tian Fong thought for a moment and realized that his own cultivation consumes toxins quickly, making it inconvenient to buy them time and time again. So he decided to say, how much do you still have in your inventory of the five toxins? If it's suitable, I'll take all of them. Chu Fei's footsteps were momentarily taken aback upon hearing this, and it was too presumptuous to just clear the inventory. There are relatively few cultivators practicing the five poisons here, but there are also twenty in stock. Taoist friends, please confirm that you want all of them. A portion of the five poisons requires 100 spirit stones, and 20 portions is 2000. This is another big order. 20 points is enough for me to practice for a while, give it all to me. After hearing this, Chu Fei dared not neglect and quickly withdrew her inventory. There were not many customers who could clear the warehouse, and her performance this month is expected to exceed the target. There are also levels of sales personnel in Jubao Pavilion. As long as the sales revenue of the staff is relatively high, they have the opportunity to be promoted and work in a higher dot level store. This is the god of wealth. Sell more, maybe I can be promoted one more level. At this moment, Chu Fei had a sense of entitlement in her heart. She guessed that the man in front of her must have come from a wealthy and prestigious family, probably the legitimate disciple of a certain demon family, otherwise she wouldn't be so wealthy. Young master, it would be better for you to understand the growth habits of toxins when practicing the poison technique. Would you like to buy a spirit pet to take care of it? Maybe it can help you. Ling Chong. Tian Fong was taken aback. Many cultivators have the habit of raising spiritual pets because after signing a contract, 
spiritual pets will not betray and can also help their masters in battles, making it a good cultivation resource. However, spiritual pets also need to grow and cultivate. Without financial support, if spiritual pets cannot grow, they cannot be of great help. Financial resources are naturally not a problem for Tian Fong. What I don't lack the most now is spirit stones. It seems that it's good to keep a spirit pet, especially when practicing poison cultivation techniques. It's important to know the habits of some toxins in order to better improve my cultivation. Tian Fong felt a little tempted and said, What kind of spiritual pets do you have here? Upon hearing that the god of wealth was interested, Chu Fei quickly pulled Tian Fong to the room where the spiritual pets were kept. This is the green bamboo snake, which likes to live among the green bamboo. The green bamboo toxin in its body can quickly numb people and make them unable to move. Tian Fong saw a small green snake crawling out of a bamboo tube, with a cold snake eye that looked like a fierce poison. Well, not bad, where's the one next to it? Tian Fong pointed to a black scorpion lying in the sand and said. This is a black-tailed scorpion, with a very hard shell and a highly toxic tail. Once infected with this scorpion poison, people will feel the pain of being pierced by 10,000 needles. This black-tailed scorpion seems to be even stronger than that green bamboo snake, Tian Fong thought to himself. I'm hungry, hurry up and get me something to eat. Just as he was deciding to buy the black-tailed scorpion, a slightly comical voice came through. Tian Fong followed the sound and found a toad talking. This toad looks a bit like the toad spirit seen in the gourd dolls when I was a child, with a somewhat silly and cute appearance. What is this? This is a long-tongued toad demon with a poisonous tongue, but the toxin is not strong. The only valuable thing is that it can speak human words. When it came to this, Chu Fei was also a bit amused. This toad had little combat power and could not sell at a high price, so it had been thrown in the corner all along. Some demon beasts have opened up their spiritual intelligence relatively early and are able to speak people's words at an early age, but in the cultivation world, the strong are still respected. These spirit pets, who can only speak but have low strength, are not very popular. If it were a mythical creature like a crane or a lark that could speak human language, perhaps it could still be sold for some price. After all, some cultivation families like to raise spiritual pets with beautiful postures and pleasant sounds as their family facade. As for a mischievous toad, these families wouldn't even buy it. Buying it would make people laugh. Chapter 9 Being Targeted by Others You are listening at NovelFull.audio Seeing this talkative toad, Tian Fong furrowed his brows and had no good impression of this ugly and powerless spirit pet. But when I think about it, I feel a bit lonely in my daily cultivation. It's also good to chat with a spiritual pet. Anyway, there are infinite spiritual stones, so I can spend and use them freely. Pack all three spirit pets, I'll take them all. Tian Fongkai said boldly that the green bamboo snake and black-tailed scorpion can enhance their combat power, and as for the long-tongued toad, it should be a playful toy for relieving worries and boredom. Gua Gua Is the young man quite insightful? I am a wild and exotic Chinese toad, and finally someone can discover my uniqueness, Gua. Puff The tea that Tian Fong drank almost sprayed out. What kind of ancient and exotic species, the Chinese toad, is commonly known as the toad? What's there to show off about? Um. Can I return this naughty toad? I was careless just now. Tian Fong regretted it a bit. He was quick-witted just now and shouldn't have wanted this big mouth trash. Sorry Taoist, I have already packed it for you. Here are three spirit beast bags, totaling 1,000 spirit stones. These three demon beasts are all early level spiritual beasts, and selling them at this price is not cheap anymore. As for why not buy higher dot level spirit beasts, because Tian Fong only has three layers of qi refining and cannot contract higher dot level ones at all. If he encounters backlash during the contract, it will be disastrous. 
However, he does not have a low level of spiritual favor, as long as the contract is completed, he can immediately use the spirit stone to elevate. After buying a spiritual pet, it was inevitable that the food that the spiritual pet liked would not be missing. After buying a large amount of food, Tian Fong finally gave up. As soon as more than 4,000 spiritual stones were gone, even Chu Fei was stunned when she saw the white colored spiritual stones. Ordinary big families don't have legitimate disciples who dare to consume like this. Who the hell is this person? She couldn't guess, but it's not important. As long as she stabilizes this customer and continues to follow this buying method, her performance will soon improve as soon as he walked out of the treasure gathering pavilion, there was a tremble in the spirit beast loan, and the mischievous toad had already jumped onto his shoulder. I'll wipe it, can you come out of the spirit beast bag yourself? Tian Fong said with a surprised expression. Normally, without the master releasing it, the spirit pet cannot come out on its own. That's natural. How could this low.level spirit beast bag keep me locked? I'm a wild and exotic Chinese toad. It's not easy to unlock the spirit beast bag. I was trapped at the foot of the Five Elements Mountain for 500 years back then, but I still came out. Stop, stop, stop. Tian Fong was puzzled and said, 500 years ago, was it not Sun Wukong, the great sage of Qi Tian, who was pinned down at the foot of Wuji Mountain? Are you bragging that this is not pure plagiarism? Can it be a bit innovative? Don't say it jumped out of a stone. You are the one who jumped out of the stone, said the mischievous toad with a displeased expression. My parents are naturally ancient and exotic, otherwise how could I have been so gifted and gifted? Everyone loves me, and flowers bloom when they see me. Tian Fong had an intuition that his ears were about to explode, and this naughty toad was too eloquent. He finally realized that something was wrong. This naughty toad is not a chatterbox, is it? I'll kick your lungs. Ahem, ahem, ahem. Listening to the constant chatter in his ear, Tian Feng's head was about to crack open. He quickly took out a teeth grinding stick to block the toad's mouth, then threw it into the storage bag and quickly tightened the opening of the bag. Let this guy nag for a while, I'm about to center the demon. If I keep it beeping, I'm afraid my lifespan will be reduced. Is it really an ancient monster? Tian Fong felt that this shopping trip was a bit unsuccessful. No wonder no one bought the talking spiritual pets. If he could see more goods, he wouldn't buy either. Just as Tian Fong stuffed the toad into the spirit beast bag, a pair of eyes were fixed on him. Hmm isn't this my human skin mask? That's right, this person is the big man who sold the leather mask to Tian Fongren that day, so he recognized him at first glance. So this kid bought a mask to go shopping at Jubao Pavilion. After a moment of contemplation, the great Han understood. I guess I went to buy some precious items, but I was afraid of being recognized, so I put on a mask to act. Just now I saw that the spirit pet that can speak people's words is quite valuable. Is it the young master of a wealthy family? The big man was skeptical, but then a sinister smile appeared on his face. Only those with lower levels of qi cultivation dare to carry heavy money for shopping. I'm afraid the great benefits of this day will fall on my head. Tian Fong naturally didn't know that he had been targeted and was still excitedly returning to his sect. However, as he passed by a poplar forest, he suddenly felt something bad. The sound of breaking through the void. He has reached three levels of cultivation and is very sensitive to the environment around him. This kind of sound of breaking through the void is self.evident, mostly a hidden weapon. He quickly moved his body and dodged three flying needles, and three flying needles hit his abdomen. Fortunately, with the protection of his armor, these three flying needles did not harm him. Oh, surprisingly, they are also wearing inner armor. There are indeed some things that low.level disciples of Qi refining can afford to wear inner armor. Following the sound, Tian Fong realized that he was the same big man who sold his mask to him. Oh, it's you. Watching the other person recognize him, 
the big man no longer concealed himself and said, It's been a long time since I last saw you, Taoist friend. I have no grudges or grievances with my fellow Taoist, why did I sneak an attack from the side? Tian Fong said angrily. Indeed, there is no injustice or hatred, but we in the demon realm are creative and can establish some hatred without it. The big man seemed to have settled on Tian Fong and said, this time my master is celebrating his 60th birthday. I have chosen a precious birthday gift, but unfortunately, there are not enough spirit stones. Since my fellow Taoist is quite valuable, why not give me some? Some of them have a pleasant name, which means killing people and stealing goods. The name of the great Han is Zhao Shi, and his master is Kuang Ming, an elder of the corpse clan. Now Zhao Shi has even sold his favorite human skin mask to celebrate Kuang Ming's birthday. Unfortunately, there are still not enough spirit stones. This time, he discovered a fat sheep, how could he let it go? Upon seeing this, Tian Fong knew that today's situation could no longer be resolved and could only adopt a combat posture, preparing to give it his all. At this moment, Zhao Shi had a black figure behind him. Tian Fong fixed his gaze and saw that it was the unique secret technique of the corpse refining sect. The body was even larger than Zhao Shi's body, with an ancient bronze color and a terrifying expression on its face. It was the copper armor corpse that Zhao Shi had painstakingly crafted. Copper armored corpses are not afraid of water and fire, not afraid of swords, and have no pain or fear. They are a powerful killing machine. Chapter 10 Hegemonic Poison Skill You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Copper Armored Corpse Tian Fong recognized at a glance that the black strong man in front of him was not a human, but a refined corpse. Although he does not practice the hidden corpse technique, he has also heard of this kind of martial art in his sect. Once a refined zombie issues an attack command, it will continue to attack endlessly unless the zombie is completely damaged or the caster is killed, which can be difficult to deal with. The movement speed of the corpse may be slow, but after being refined, it becomes different. Its speed skyrockets, basically not much different from that of cultivators of the same level. Zhao Shi is a cultivator with five levels of qi cultivation, belonging to the standard middle stage of qi cultivation, so the bronze armored corpse is basically also a cultivator at this level. Kill him. Zhao Shi issued an order with a murderous intent. The originally expressionless bronze armored corpse received the command and its eyes suddenly became sharp, revealing black mottled fangs. It rushed towards the target. It's really scary. Seeing the zombie being slaughtered, Tian Fong also felt a bit guilty. However, he has been practicing for a while to have the power to protect himself. At this moment, he is no longer hiding his foolishness and is doing his best. Jiao Da's sword of one sword goes off path. Tian Fong offered the black crystal sword, which was driven by magic and flew in mid-air, appearing very agile and full of attack power. Slash. As Tian Feng's voice sounded, the black crystal sword landed on the zombie's chest in one fell swoop. The speed of zombies is not slow, but compared to swordsmanship, they are naturally insignificant. Sword cultivation is known for its fast speed, especially for swordsmanship like Jiao De Yijian, that attacks unprepared opponents with speed and acceleration. The zombie couldn't react at all, and a sword was struck on its chest, instantly leaving a deep wound. Hmm, it's amazing that it could injure my bronze armored corpse. It seems that this sword is also a good thing. I want to make a big profit. Zhao Shi immediately recognized the extraordinary nature of the sword. The body of the bronze armored corpse was very hard, and ordinary weapons could be said to be difficult to damage. However, the sword could still function, indicating that its quality was not low. This is a magic tool that Tian Fenghua bought at a high price. Not to mention that he is a small disciple in the early stage of qi refining, even a mid-stage disciple can use it without any problem. However, Tian Feng's strength is still too weak, and this degree of damage is nothing to the copper armored corpse, still rushing towards Tian Feng. 
Damn it, is it so fierce. Tian Foam was helpless, with a cold sweat on his head. He wanted to use his sword to chop this zombie to pieces. Without a thousand or eight hundred swords, he probably wouldn't be able to do it, but he didn't have the strength to wield so many swords. He he, in the early stage of refining Qi, there was only one dead end when facing my copper armored corpse. Zhao Shi grinned as if he had already thought of the pleasure of slaughtering fat sheep. After receiving the spirit stone, prepare a birthday gift and offer it to Master Kuang Ming. Perhaps one can promote their identity to a true disciple. Unlike Zhao Shi's ease, Tian Feng's side can be said to be plagued by dangers of being forced by zombies. The sex hidden corpse technique is indeed impressive. I knew I had also refined a copper armored corpse. He has some regrets, but the most important thing first is to lift the crisis. It's impossible to kill zombies, so there's only one way to go, and that's to kill this despicable man. Tian Fang's eyes showed a hint of malice. Since the other party wanted his life, there was no need to hold back. Jiao De's sword is brilliant and brilliant, the sword was infused with a large amount of mana, unleashing the second move of the sword technique. For a moment, the sword's shadow was heavy, making it impossible to distinguish its true body. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. The sword kept cutting through the zombie's body, hindering its movement. It's useless, even if all the mana is used up, it won't harm the root of the copper armored corpse. Zhao Shi immediately saw that this swordsmanship was quite mana intensive and couldn't last long, so he didn't even care about it. However, Tian Feng's original intention was not to kill the zombie. His intention was to kill the speller, and without the speller, the zombie would naturally stop. Just as the zombie was trapped by swordsmanship, Tian Feng jumped up and headed straight for Zhao Shi. Give me a slap. He mobilized all his strength and attempted to kill the enemy on the spot with palm power. However, upon seeing this scene, Zhao Shi showed a disdainful expression. Although the idea is good, do you think that just refining three layers of qi can hurt me? Zhao Shi is two small levels higher than him, and he simply disdains Tian Feng's attack. Since you're looking for death, I'll personally take you on your way. Zhao Shi did not retreat but advanced, gathered his strength, and slapped. Crushed Stone Palm This is a palm cultivation technique, although relatively low dot level, it is completely sufficient to deal with people with lower levels than oneself. The two palms collided without any suspense, and Tian Feng was propelled far away by the opponent's palm power. Finally, he collided with a poplar tree before stopping. Tian Feng's right hand involuntarily trembled slightly, clearly injured, but he did not show any signs of pain. Instead, he showed a sly smile. Zhao Shi originally intended to seize the opportunity to pursue and save the life of this fat sheep on the spot, but for some reason, a heart-wrenching pain came from his palm. Well, what's going on? Zhao Shi stopped and looked at his palm, only to find a black aura emanating from it. Toxic. He suddenly understood that during the palm power competition just now, the opponent took the opportunity to inject toxins into his body. Damn it! I didn't expect you to use poison again. Zhao Shi was shocked and pale. It goes without saying what poisoning meant. He didn't take any more action and quickly took a detoxification pill from his storage bag, trying to suppress the toxins in his body. But for some reason, the detoxification pill doesn't seem to have much effect, and the toxin still spreads rapidly in the body. As long as it reaches the heart meridian, the cultivator will undoubtedly die. The five poisons technique, combined with the special toxins formed by the cultivator themselves, cannot be eliminated by ordinary detoxification pills. The five poisons technique is extremely domineering, and if operated improperly, it can even poison the cultivator to death. However, once mastered, this kind of domineering toxin is not easily tolerable by others. Ah! Feeling the heart-wrenching pain, Zhao Shi's eyes turned red. It seemed that the speed of toxin transmission was fast, and his vitality was rapidly losing. Damn it, it's really damn it. 
I can't live, don't even think about living. At this moment, Zhao Xiu has gone crazy. At the last moment of his life, he wants to use Tian Feng as a cushion for him, so he is no longer on guard and comes with all his strength to kill him, ready to die together. However, Tian Feng would not give him this opportunity. He had already released the poison-tailed scorpion and green bamboo snake, and they were now hiding in the dark to attack, making it extremely difficult to guard against. The venomous scorpion crawled out from the ground and stung Zhao Xiu's leg fiercely with a venomous needle, while the green bamboo snake climbed up the branch of the poplar tree early and jumped down, biting Zhao Xiu's neck. At the same time, two poisonous substances exerted their force, and Zhao Xiu finally reached his limit. His face turned black, and the poison was released on the spot.